replaced with this, uh, we couldn't find enough Jersey cedar, so this cedar is actually from British Columbia. Um, the whole, this back part where the bathrooms, the public bathrooms are, that's new. Uh, the air conditioning, the heating system are new, the plumbing system has been renewed, the electrical system, and the windows have all been uh, repaired and replaced. Uh, as well as uh, work on the structure and the foundation. So it was a very extensive, uh, it was a two-year project after about two or three years of uh, research to figure out what had to be done. The state of New Jersey gave us an award for um, historic preservation. Uh, it was a combination 2020-2021 award. And um, yeah, it was very prestigious. Only like eight, eight groups in the state got that honor. So uh, we feel, and we were one of the very few groups south of the Raritan River that got any recognition. So. And then there were structural things like this. The, the footing was wrong. Uh, we had to do that. We had to put heat and air conditioning in. Um, we had to refinish the floors. We had to do well. Um, all of the Utilities, the electric, everything was needed to be completely replaced. This is a store window that's on the inside, and we can feel it here. But so they took all these windows to a factory workshop up in Trenton, took all the paint off, took all the glass out, and it like say just this little piece of wood was broken. They'd repair it, and then they put it all back together. Uh, and so these are actually. We think the original windows. And this was sort of the most recent renovation. Yeah, yeah. No, it was it was extremely professional. Um, they did a really nice job. And one of the nice things is that a lot of people complain about historic preservation. It's expensive. It's whatever. But what we one of the things the county I think hoped to accomplish is mostly when you go for a historic building, you go to Williamsburg, Princeton, Morristown, Philadelphia, someplace like that, right? This is now, this is in among where people live and they can see the methods of um, what it means to, to accurately restore a building. 